Kylian Mbappe is a modern-day example of an early bloomer. In December 2015, he made his senior squad debut for Monaco. He scored his first hat-trick for the squad a year later, and finally played a pivotal part as the team overcame Paris Saint-Germain (PSG) in the Ligue 1 title race. He made his World Cup debut for France in 2018 and led them to a historic victory, winning the tournament's Best Young Player award. He won the last three Ligue 1 Golden Boots and has emerged as a major Ballon d'Or contender. Despite his achievements so far, many feel Mbappe has to leave PSG in order to take the next step and stand on the same podium as Lionel Messi and Ronaldo, among others. Real Madrid appears to be the Frenchman's favored destination, although nothing has been confirmed. We'll take a trip through Mbappe's outstanding career at PSG today and present viewers five reasons why we believe Mbappe is jeopardizing his career at PSG and why a move away from the French capital is imminent sooner rather than later. 1. The league is less competitive. France has established themselves as a successful footballing superpower following their facile World Cup victory in 2018. Among its competitors, the national team has probably the strongest squad. They also have a track record of performing well in major tournaments, thus dismissing France's football culture would be unreasonable. Despite the national team's exploits at the World Cup, France's domestic league does not have the mass appeal that the Premier League or even La Liga do. PSG, as a club, are not in the same bracket as the likes of Real Madrid, Barcelona, Manchester United, Liverpool, or even Chelsea. To become a familiar face, he must play in leagues that provide greater exposure. He must show how he fares against some of the toughest opponents in the business. The League One is bursting with talent and potential, but it isn't considered on an equal pedestal with its peer leagues in terms of competition. PSG's dominance in the domestic league and financial clout have proven that. Kylian Mbappe has unquestionably world-class talent. However, if he shows his abilities and potential in more competitive leagues, he has the potential to become a world-class player. Mbappe may want to emulate his idol, Cristiano Ronaldo, by showing his worth in different leagues in the years to come. Moving to a new league will be a step forward for the PSG striker, perhaps propelling Mbappe to greater heights in his career. Kylian Mbappe has only played in France so far and is familiar with the surroundings. However, to excel as a top individual, it is often important to go beyond one's comfort zone. Even Lionel Messi, who has only played in La Liga so far, has had to adapt to Argentina's brand of football while playing international matches. 2. Time is running out. At the age of 24 years, both Ronaldo and Messi have won the Ballon d'Or, Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi are undoubtedly the two most popular figures in the world of football. Not only did the two superstars smash every record in sight, but they also managed to establish themselves as marketable global legends, something Mbappe must further develop away from PSG. Despite his age, Kylian Mbappe is one of the best players in the world. However, if he is to become one of the greatest players in history, he will need a squad that revolves around him. Players like Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi have this quality, which has helped them become football legends. Similarly, Mbappe would want to play for a squad in which he is the main man. Like Messi and Ronaldo, the young Frenchman ought to strive to make his own way. And leaving PSG and joining a legendary prominent club appears to be the ideal answer at this moment. Except for the Champions League, Mbappe has practically won it all for Paris Saint-Germain. Regardless of his best efforts, he has not been a serious candidate for the prestigious individual accolade, the Ballon d'Or. As great as Paris Saint-Germain are, they cannot be considered a hotbed for Ballon d'Or winners. Real Madrid, Manchester United and Barcelona, on the other hand, have an excellent track record of promoting Ballon d'Or winners, and it makes for Mbappe to get into the good graces of any of the three. 3. Champions League Failure Mbappe joined PSG in 2017 with the hope of returning to his hometown and becoming part of a Champions League winning side. Le Parisien have yet to win the UEFA Champions League, which resulted in extremely big spending in the club's finances. Mbappe has already won five League One crowns in his career, but he has yet to win the Champions League. During his last five seasons at PSG, they were knocked out at the round of 16 stage on three occasions. 
The League One side also reached the semi-finals in 2020 21 and lost against Bayern Munich in the 2020 final. Winning the Champions League and being PSG's all-time top scorer are part of my objectives. But there are more than that, Mbappé said in an interview with BFM TV. The Champions League is a clear objective that's been established and announced. We don't need any more adjectives to describe the Champions League. We want to win it, and we have a way. PSG are currently in Group F of the Champions League, in what is determined to be the group of death, with the likes of AC Milan, Dortmund, and Newcastle. The 23-year-old, who is PSG's all-time Champions League leading scorer, may have to go elsewhere if he wants to get his hands on old big ears. Mbappe's window to win the Champions League with PSG appears to be closing. As a result, he might turn to other teams that are better positioned to help him win the coveted trophy. 4. Wrong Position Mbappe has shown for the Paris club. However, he has had to deal with continuous changes in management and, as a result, changing mentalities. PSG has always been a work-in-progress club, with regular management changes. He has played as a center striker for PSG, but rumors indicate that the forward is dissatisfied with the position and would want to play alongside a striking partner, as he did for France. In Didier Deschamps' system, Olivier Giroud acts as the focal point of attack, which allows Mbappe to make runs off his teammate. I play differently with France, he told reporters after a 2-0 win over Austria in the UEFA Nations League. I'm asked other things here compared to with my club. I have a lot more freedom here. The coach knows that there is a number nine like Olivier who occupies the defenses, and I can walk around and go into space. In Paris, it's different, there isn't that. I am asked to do the pivot. It is different. Mbappe posted on Instagram after a zero, zero draw against Rhymes to vent his emotions in a now-deleted post. He shared a photo of himself with the caption Pivot Gang, implying that he does not appreciate playing through the center by himself. PSG made a lot of promises to Mbappe during contract negotiations, which led him to reject Real Madrid and stay at the club. The club affirms to sign a new striker so that he may play in his best position off the striker and that he will be in the center of the project. All of the promises have not been fulfilled. Therefore, the prospect of playing with a squad with more settled players like Real Madrid would be appealing to him. Also, the prospect of playing with Vinicius Jr., Rodrigo, Camavinga, and even Jude Bellingham would be a dream for the young Frenchman because these are all players of great talent and skills. With his potential and ability, he will surely reach the desired destination. 5. Too much power. Mbappe was allegedly granted a large say in off-field decisions and appointments within PSG's hierarchy as part of the arrangement to extend his stay at the Parc des Princes. He allegedly chose Luis Campos as their sports director, although that amount of individual control might create issues inside the dressing room. Neymar recently liked two social media posts criticizing Mbappe, including one claiming the France international controlled the club. According to L'Equipe, the winger has been blown away by the amount of power Mbappe has been given. I don't think a football club should allow a player to have any type of power that they look bigger than the club, Rio Ferdinand said on BT Sport after PSG's won one draw with Benfica. At the moment, the narrative suggests that Kylian Mbappe is the bigger powerhouse in that relationship and that can't be right. If Mbappe has become an unpopular figure in the PSG dressing room due to his power. The night before the zero, zero clash with Clermont on September 30th, Mbappe took teammates Hakimi, Dembele, Kurzawa out in Paris to see Cedric Dumbe's MMA fight a move that undermined the seriousness of the Parisian players' preparations. However, the media outlet also claims that Real would consider that the players' decline in performance would be due to a lack of motivation, a trend that would surely be reversed in the event of signing in Madrid. Finally, Mbappe was heavily linked with a transfer to Real Madrid. However, he's now regretting that decision of staying at PSG as his relationship with the club has broken down, and Europe's biggest clubs will be looking to sign him during the January transfer window. Without a question, Kylian Mbappe is one of the top players in the world. Since his debut in 2016, the Frenchman has established himself as the world's top young talent. 
When he joined Paris Saint-Germain from Monaco in 2017, he became the second most expensive transfer in history. Mbappe has 106 goals in over 120 games for Paris Saint-Germain and has won every domestic trophy. He is already being pursued by the world's most powerful clubs. Despite his apparent success at PSG, it is time for him to move on. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos on your favorite sport. Until the next one, stay tuned.